that you guys have gone through so much as a team already. And it's only halfway through a season. And what's your thought on what you want to accomplish in the second half of the group? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I think you, there's no sense really looking at it too, too big. I think you just kind of take it a game at a time. And uh, for us, that's uh, having a good game tomorrow. And, uh, and then we got a, a, a pretty big road trip coming up. So um, that, that'll be the focus now. And, and then once that's uh, happened, uh, we'll move on from there. As you get a little healthier, do you get the sense you're getting more consistent efforts? Most nights, I mean, the game in Detroit obviously wasn't good, but a lot of the games recently, you either won or, you know, like Dallas and Detroit, you've been right there. Yeah, I think it's it's good sign that you're always that we're always in the game. Um, we just have to find. I think that's it's kind of been a theme. We've got to find a way to close out some of those games. Um, <clears throat> and then there have been some some good games for us where we have closed things out. So um, we just keep building and and um, yeah, I think it's it's going to be nice. Uh, Eventually, when we get to back to sort of, um, I don't know if we'll get fully there, but more guys healthy. Every, when guys come back in the lineup, it's it's always a, a nice little boost. So um, hopefully, we can get a couple guys back for next game and um, and and sort of feed off the energy they bring. Guys, talk about how close this group is. Like, how do you, how, do you, how do you see that closeness? Like, what what tells you this group is so close? I guess. Um. I don't know. I mean, I guess just sort of a feel. I think how guys sort of personalities mix. Sometimes, um, sometimes guys are good guys. They just don't don't mix well. So, um, but I think in this team, there's a lot of guys that are, are pretty close away from the rink, and um, I think that's always better than than the opposite. So, um, we got a lot of young guys. A lot of guys uh, sort of hungry for their opportunity, and, and a lot of excitement around that, and. Uh, um, guys can kind of feed off that, which is which has been nice. What is Tuck brought to your line that is really meshed right away? I mean, he's got a point a game. You're scoring. Cage is scoring. What has he brought to the line that has made it now? Um, I mean, he's just he's just a really good player. I don't know. I, I mean, his skill set, I guess, is is complementary in the fact that um, he's 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 a big body and he can he can. He can really move, and uh, but I think that's sort of complimentary to anyone really in this league. So, um, yeah, it's been really fun playing with him. He's 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 got some some real good skills with the puck, um, and because of his size and speed, he 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 can create space and um, and when he gets the puck, he can make plays. So um, it's it's been really fun to 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 get to play with him and. Uh, yeah, hopefully we can keep it keep it going. Is this enthusiasm? Is that contagious? Yeah, I mean, obviously he brings a lot of energy, um, which is nice. I mean, it's uh, again, it's something you can feed off. He, he brings energy, he brings um, excitement, and uh, yeah, like a positive attitude. I think it's 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 something that um, guys gravitate towards, which is uh, which is a good thing. So, um, but yeah, I don't. I don't. I think that's just kind of who he is. I don't think he's sort of going through kind of a, a good spell here. I think that's kind of who he is, which is which is good because that's gonna that's gonna last a, a long time. You have two more Saturday, <clears throat> so you're up to 16. In the last couple of years, the shooting percentage numbers are way down. It's back up where you were the first year here, where you were in Carolina. Just how much is that a reflection? You know, you're you're going harder than that. You're going harder to the puck. You want to be in those areas, and it's paying off. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I mean, I think there's those all th those all of those things kind of play into it. Um, but there's 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 so many factors. So, um, but yeah, I think all those things are 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 definitely things that you want in your game, and when they are in your game, um, good things are going to happen. Good results are going to come. Um, so yeah, maybe maybe those those. Those have uh, have gotten better, but I think um, there's there's so many factors, and 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 for me, I think shooting percentage. I don't I don't I don't know. Sometimes it's I don't know how you can you can look at it and and sort of um, zero in on like if you're if you're shooting ten percent and you've shot nine shots, your your next one's not guaranteed to go in, right? So 
I think it's just kind of accumulation of a lot of things. And uh, for me personally, I think uh, this last little stretch, Tucky and, and Tommy have been playing really well. And uh, when a line's playing well, guys are going to have success individually. And uh, I think hopefully we can keep it going together. You just talked at the top here, obviously, about a one game at a time approach. That's pretty standard. Do you allow yourself to think, you know, I can get back in that 30 35 goal range this year? Yeah, never come into um, not really. I mean, I think for me, you you just have a certain expectation of how you're going to play and how you can perform and, and how you're going to help the team. And um, I know that that is a standard line one game at a time, but you're not going to get to at around 30 goals or 35 goals in, in the next time you score. So for me, I think it's just about each game um, – uh, producing sort of as much as I feel like I'm capable of doing and, and helping the team uh, in the way that I should be. And when you stack those games together, it, um, there's an expectation of, of where I think that I'll end up, and um, that'll kind of be what it'll be. It's, it's, it's no sense really thinking about it tomorrow or thinking about it the next day. It's just kind of it's, it's going to be what it's going to be. I think I just focus on how I can help the team tomorrow and, and, and then that thing will take care of itself.